Hey everybody, today we are out at Caprock Canyon State Park in Texas. And uh, this is a really cool place because we've got some really interesting rocks here behind me. I'm going to take a couple of videos um, out here to show you the whole thing. Um, but the rock that's here behind me, let me, let me get out of the way here because it's way more interesting than me. Um, all of this rock is Permian uh, in age, so we're going back before the dinosaurs. And this whole area was one big basin um, that had formed, and we've got this big ocean uh, that's covering most of North America at this point in time. So if we take a look at the rock, there's a couple of really cool things in here. So this rock, this red rock that we see, this is kind of a silty sand uh, layer that's in here. If you, if you kind of feel it, you can feel a little bit of that sand in there. And it's red. And anytime we see the color red, that's telling us that there's iron in the rock. And the iron's just oxidizing, right? Just like your car door, right? If it rusts, it's doing the same thing. So there's a lot of iron uh, in this rock. Most of this material washed in uh, from erosion. And as it sit, sat in the basin, uh, it was interacting with the oxygen and oxidized. Now there's a couple of other neat things we can see in here. Let me see if I I can get up this way. So right here we actually have some mud layers, uh, these mud stringers that are kind of running through here. So you can, you can definitely see this color difference right here. Right, You've got that oxidized iron up there and right here in this mud there is no iron in there whatsoever. So that's that's pretty neat, right? That's a really interesting environmental change. Um, but in my opinion the coolest thing here is these white bands that sit through here. Let me Let me bring it down here to this one. So this is gypsum, uh, and if you take a look, you can, you can see these mineral bands going up and down. Uh, gypsum is the mineral that makes plaster. Um, so if you have sheetrock in your house, this is, or plaster walls, right? This is the mineral that makes up the plaster and the sheetrock. Um, but the way that gypsum forms is from evaporation. So as the water was sitting in this basin, uh, it was cut off from the ocean, and the water started evaporating out of the basin. Now when water evaporates, the minerals that are dissolved in the water don't evaporate out into the water. Instead, they're gonna stay behind, right? Which is one, which is how we form salt, right? So all the salt that you use on your food, right, formed from that type of evaporation. But we can also form these pretty beautiful gypsum layers. Um, some of this can also come from reworking of water too, right? You get these nice, beautiful veins as they come up in here. So some pretty neat things. So I'm gonna come back and show you another uh, couple of videos to show you what's going on with the erosion in here as well. 